Gosh. <laughs> Now in verse 22, Luke 13, and he went through the cities and villages, teaching and journeying toward Jerusalem. <laughs> then said one unto him, Lord, are there few that be saved? <laughs> and he said unto them, Strive to enter in at the straight gate. <laughs> For many, I say unto you, will seek to enter in and shall not be able. <laughs> when once the master of the house is risen up and hath shut the door, <laughs> And ye begin to stand without and to knock at the door, saying, Lord, Lord, <laughs> open unto us. And he shall answer and say unto you, I know you not whence ye are. <laughs> then shall ye begin to say, We have eaten and drunk in thy presence, and thou hast taught in our streets. <laughs> but he shall say, I tell you, I know you not whence ye are. <laughs> Depart from me, all ye workers of iniquity. <laughs> Then shall be weeping and gnashing of teeth, when ye shall see Abraham and Isaac and Jacob and all the prophets in the kingdom of God, and you yourselves thrust out. And they shall come from the east and from the west and from the north and from the south, and shall sit down in the kingdom of God. And behold, there are last which shall be first, and there are first which shall be last. Now, um, obviously... Jesus, yes, uh, he had some phobias. <laughs> and this concept of we all go to heaven, well, I don't think that's supported by the Bible. <laughs> Not everybody gets into the kingdom of heaven, and you can go to your personal kingdom, wherever that might be. <laughs> but for those that are Christians, they have to actually acknowledge that not everybody gets in because when the door is shut, <laughs> you can knock all you want, but you won't get in. Now, um, I'm concerned about the various phobias that Jesus had while, <laughs> well, obviously, he had fears, yes. compulsive fears that, um, well, look at here. Oh. Verse 44, let these sayings sink down into your ears, for the Son of Man shall be delivered into the hands of men. <laughs> Somewhat of a persecutory delusion that he had that somebody was going to try to kill him. <laughs> you know, they did eventually crucify him, and for some reason he was afraid that certain individuals disliked him, and they would want to find him not guilty or guilty. <laughs> You know, when you think of the actual court hearing where Jesus was accused of various crimes, <coughs> I thought he was innocent, <coughs> but a lot of you thought he was guilty and deserved to be crucified. <coughs> now, he had a, a type of delusion that he thought that there were those that wanted to kill him, and <laughs> you would say it's really a phobia, <coughs> a compulsive fear of the belief that somebody was persecuting him. <coughs> 